couple of weeks ago. Roberto Rodighiero. Music from Piazzola. But only a double toe. She was caught in between. I wasn't sure if she was going to go with a triple or not. Better on the triple flip. Well, Fax is in the air, but held firm. but just about ran on the double axle. Yeah, snatched at the entry a little bit. More build-up than we've seen from a lot of the other skaters this afternoon. But she made it. Made it count. Roberto Rodighiero. Dramatic finish. But the start didn't set her off too well with that combination jump, and it really rather set the tone. Roberta Rodighiero. So, compared with the sparkling Roberta performances that we've had, Italy. that was a little disappointing. Well, there was plenty to admire in there, I think. It's a testament to how high the standard has been that that did look a little bit subpar. The judges will be looking for areas to deduct, and there were deductions to be had there. That hesitation before going into jumps. She'll probably get a minus one just for that alone. And then, of course, as you say, the error on the combination, which I'm sure we'll have another look at. At least a minus two, I would expect, on that triple-triple combination. First one went to plan, not the height, decent travel, but it's a good landing on that, but just too much forward rotation. Got the toe pit caught on the landing. I think that's a minus two on the grade of execution. Triple flip here again, very little height. She feels well to get around. Late with the free leg. She made it all count though. She did very well on that front. Same with the triple act, the double axle. She'd definitely be in contention if she was doing a triple axle. Here's that double axle. Far more of a build up than we've seen from lots of them. All wrong in the air. Comfortable on the landing though. Just a little slower than some of the routines that we've seen. 
that was definitely noticeable. I think the component score will be down, the skating skills. She had nice clean edges, good quality, but definitely the speed not there through the step sequence as well. Good spins, not great spins, just not quite achieving the sort of positions that that incredible flexibility of the Russians allows. But as I say, it just goes to show how high the standard is. Franca Bianconi on the right, as we look, and Rosanna Morante. Our two coaches in Bergen. 52-57, uh, she's in last place just behind Kutvalska, but within touch. Still a chance for her to move up a couple of places tomorrow, but at the moment, looks like she's going